Hello, and welcome to Dark Pictures House of Ashes. Let's get started. Alright, ooh, I'm already loving the setting and the weird, mysterious man in the background. Let's play Don't Play Alone, or Play Alone, because I don't have any friends right now. Let's see, Cursed Akkad. Uh, ooh, I don't know. Cause I don't want to. I don't want to do lethal, but I also don't want to do like challenging. Cause I've I've never played this game before. Um, survival is expected. Your skills will be tested. And let's just do forgiving. Screw it. New slot. For they have sown the wind, and they shall reap with the whirlwind. Jose H7. Every choice has a consequence. Some decisions save lives. Others lead to death. Very macabre beginning. Choose wisely. Oh, man, crow. I'll do as you say, Crow, because you crowed at me. Uh, hello? Oh. Silence! Your words are meaningless here. Your blood will pay the debt our king demands. Your sacrifice will lift his curse from our land. General Barato, forgive me, my lord. The king demands your urgent presence. The gods smile on you. For now. Take this one back to the cell. I'll deal with him later. You're in luck, Gutian. Luck? No. No luck for these dogs. General, we should leave this place. The king, his madness threatens to swallow us all. This temple is cursed. I'd rather die in this cursed house than perish to the plague and famine out there. We have our orders, Captain. You just might get your wish. I love the whole beard style too on that dude. Just... The moon god sends you to destroy my kingdom. I know it, girl. I see everything. Look around you. Is this hall not famous enough for my mistakes? Do the gods not bask in its glory? The Gutians are coming, General. The moon god sends an army to destroy us. I shall muster our forces immediately. Good. And what news from below? There are hundreds of prisoners, my king. Their sacrifice will take time. Time is no longer in our hands. No matter. The blood of this army will nourish the sands. The sacrifice will be fulfilled. Starting with this one. <laughs> Tell me, General, does she remind you of anyone? My king? Do you not see a hint of your own daughter in her? What age would she have been now? Eighteen. Eighteen? Hmm. What a tragedy this plague has been. Kill her. Oh, I don't know. Ooh, I don't know. Uh... My king, would it not be wise to keep the girl alive? She's an enemy scout. 
We could learn the Gutian's plans. No. Every drop of blood brings us closer to salvation. She must die. Well, there he goes trying to save her. Shit, I don't know which... It's not telling me which button. I'm guessing in the controls when it's dark gray, you have to click it. Nah, it's a little bit weird, but that's okay. But damn, you didn't have to be that harsh, bro. <gasps> oh, so you won't show that, but you'll show her getting a spear through the chest. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, you'll show that. All right. Never mind. Still very bloody and gory. <laughs> Don't lose your head. Assassin's Creed moves right there, bro. Hell yeah. Big mouth. Scream up into the heavens. In the sky. In the sun. Give me strength. You're gonna need more than strength from the gods. And the good king, the great king, the good, great, evil king is dead.
Forgiveness, but the gods don't listen. And now he too is silent. I don't think he had any choice in the matter. Even my daughter's death couldn't wait me to the truth. I followed a fool. Uh, oh, okay. Balathu and Karum. Balathu seemed relieved at the death of his king. Uh, actually, that is pretty well true. He did seem like he was. Which I don't blame him. This king seemed like kind of an asshole. Let's see. Oh, wait, there's wait, wait, there's videos to this. Hold on. Why? Wait. Uh, I guess it doesn't go in chronological order. Oh well, I'm not gonna do anything yet with that. Current objective, work together to escape. View Baluth, Balathu's rela relationship with Karu. Aw, they're in a gay relationship. Hell yeah, very progressive for the time. Don't let his ruin become ours. This is your temple. What can we do? There is a way out through the catacomb. You think I should trust you? You have no choice. Wait, did they close the door behind them? So it's a light gray, like basically white that you have to press. I gotta remember that. Follow me. There is a way out through this door. Door? Yes. Oh gosh. For the builders when they're done. Come. Oh god. I fucked up. An Akkadian? Scared of a rodent? I have seen it all now. I should really look Hold at the directions step. before I just start Hold clicking step. buttons. They died in vain. What a mad king. Press and hold. That interaction was, so I won't be able to do it uh, next time. Use W to move. Hell yeah. Move camera and light source. At least I can finally interact with my character now. Uh, something shiny. We like shiny things. Premonition. 
Horizon View Print Edition. Oh, okay. It's a zombie. So, wait, is that basically what it is? It's just a zombie? Zombie person? Alright, so we saw that. There's the door that I think we came in. Hey, what's up, bud? How you doing? Thank you for not killing me right off the bat. Why did your king create the temple? Same story that history has taught us. For gold. For glory. For greed. Sounds like presidents and politicians today, actually. So not much different. Alright, I've basically already inspected it, so I don't need to do anything with it. Can I look down the hole? No, I can't. That's a big hole, though. I like big holes, and I can't not lie. The, I already inspected that. Let me look at the doorway. Or the door. Uh. Yeah, should I? Uh, hey. Uh. uh ba Baluth. Ba Baluth. Whatever the hell your name is. Uh, get, should we open the door? I don't know if we should open the door. Wait, hold on. Are there multiple doors? Uh, okay, good. I was about to say, if I have to open multiple doors, that's going to be a problem. Because odds are, this is one of those games where you have multiple choices. And one of them is wrong. Uh, fuck it, let's open it. Here, help me with this. safe down here. You first. Smart idea. And you do not know if you're safe down here. What is this that adorns you? The history of Gutian. You are guardians fought hard to destroy our people. But mark my words. Our story has just begun. How do we get out of here alive? Yeah, let's, let's be respectful. The enemy of my enemy is a friend. We helped you. Hell yeah, the power of friendship. Hold hands and sing Kumbaya. Uh oh, we're moving now? Okay, cool. What was that? How many ways into this tomb? Not alone down here. Oh, really? Exit. Okay, cool. Over here. You just knocked a closed door behind you. Coming! I know. A guardian. There's no escape. Our only hope is to stand together. No. If we both run, then we both die. Ready your sword. Um. Um.
Yeah, get him! Won't you spare me over till another on the choices you make. They will be as a compass guiding you through the unknown. Will you find the path to salvation or be lost in the darkness forever? Let me speak plainly. You are about to make some difficult decisions. Decisions that will affect the lives of others. How those decisions play out will become clear over time. I expect you're wondering who I am and where you are. Yeah, naturally. Care to enlighten me? I am the curator, the custodian of tales. My purpose is to keep a record of everything you do, every decision or mistake you make. This is my repository. It's filled with untold stories. Stories about friends and enemies. Loyalty and betrayal. Life. And death. Understand that I am not here to help you. And what good are you? Although, I have been known to bend the rules time to time yeah that's my man hell yeah to descend into the unknown alone is extremely brave or extremely foolish perhaps there is more to you than meets the eye 
Let me give you a few words of advice. Throughout the story, you will encounter certain pictures, pictures which allude to possible outcomes. I suggest you pay attention to their meaning. It could foreshadow a future best avoided. But alas, the sands of time have run out for us. We'll meet again soon to see how you fare. Poor Pale. Shit, we went from like the 1500s to now 2000 feet. Jason Kolchak versus Confident and intolerant. Good drip. Eric Kane. Rational and ins ooh, he's rational and insecure. Not particularly. Welcome to Camp Slayer. You're early. Apologies for arriving early, Lieutenant. Things are moving fast. I hear you, Colonel. Glad to have you on board. Gotta Text make sure we keep friends. Presentation. As soon as we get word from the CEO, we're good to go. You should read this. Can you hear? There's a new king in the castle. Looks that way. Ooh, now who are you? You are? This is my assistant, Clarice Stokes. Dr. Clarice Stokes. Gold check. First lieutenant. Gold check. Well, wow. the briefing room? Yeah, my goal throughout this game is to stay as friendly with everyone as possible. So we all can work together to survive. What the? Damn. Already? It's that okay. fast? Can't you keep up? And why does she have no chin? Rachel King, commanding and abrasive. Nick K, defensive and romantic. Aww. He's a romantic. This could be our last time and together, he's... Rachel. After what happened at the checkpoint. Oh yeah, he's gonna be I thought I was commanding done. over her throughout this whole game, this I guarantee weeks, it. You've, you've lifted me up. I don't know where I'd be without you. Ugh. Ugh. Rachel King? Colonel King has arrived on base, ma'am. He's en route to the briefing room. I'll be there in five. Fuck, it's him. He's early. Your husband, you mean? Don't you think it's about time you came clean? Put your clothes back on. Straighten up. Ooh, that just got interesting. Hey, Rachel, are you going to tell him about us or what? You and Eric have been apart for a year. Whatever you had, it, it's got to be over. Come on. Baby, I just don't think this is the right time. That's bullshit. There's never a right time. Soon, Nick. I promise. Soon. That's why you don't go into a military relationship. It does not end breathing. well almost ever. Shit. <sighs> you put that on yourself, girl. Well, actually, you both kind of put that on yourselves. There we go. Keep the lighter. You never know when you need it. You'll have to excuse the noise and disorder. We're just getting the base set up. Hmm. Blows my mind. Only a few weeks ago, Saddam was living it up in here. <laughs> Chowing down in candy bars while some poor bastard clipped his toenail. Nice image. Uh. If only you could see the state of this place now. It makes me smile. <laughs> Got the CIA. Nope. Okay, we're the moving. Army, the Marines, DIA, the Air Force. Hey, everyone. Out of the way. I'm the commanding officer. I stay up front. God bless America. I 
see you, old man. Be busting out those reps. Hey, you come join me. Maybe I'll teach you a thing or two. Later. We have company. Yeah. This here would like to watch me get my sweat on. You wanna spot me, little lady? I can see you just fine from here, thanks. <laughs> that a girl. Hell yeah. You like social skills. Uh, I guess every unit has its resident jackass. Sergeant K. This is Lieutenant Colonel Kane. Just taking him down to the briefing room. Yeah, gotta go get prepped. I'll see you in there, Marine. So what's his malfunction? Nick ain't been himself lately. We got caught up in a shooting a few weeks back. His civilian ate a bullet. Nick took it hard. Is he combat ready? He's a big boy, sir. He's ready. No, there's more to it than that. I can trust trust you that. Damn, Joey, they got you sitting behind a desk? You want me to make a call? Nah, I'm all good. People who sit behind desks don't tend to catch so many bullets, you know? So this must be uh, the one and only satellite guy. <laughs> the one and only satellite guy. I'm Eric King. Lieutenant Colonel Eric King. Give the Colonel full sight access. He looks like a turtle. Sir. I'm sorry, but he does. He'd be like me if I was in the military. I'm telling you, when the queen bitch finds out about this, she's gonna flip her shit. That's my wife you're talking about. I had no idea, I'm sorry. Nice work, hot shot. Sir, I'm so sorry. Rachel never said she was married. We've been working apart this last year. So, she's the queen bitch now. She's gone up in the world. If it helps, we like to think of it as a term of endearment. Starting on the right foot, I see. Right. Let's get you shut up. I hope the band was see. Can with you Wait for the team. I'll leave the, the techie stuff room. to you. Now what do we got? What do we got? We got uh, ooh, examine. What is this place anyway? It looks like an old barn. Right. Subject urgent well, results exactly needed. What it is. Confidential. With the survey like group becoming operational point. today, it is imperative to stress the need for mission success. Our military that. operations need a clear and compelling uh, end state. U.S. US forces have been engaged in a threat to the international anymore. community from Iraq, WMD. As as you don't step on my Until we prove that threat, we cannot rightly justify the invasion of international law. Uh, oh. I guess that's all we're going to be able to get. So much for letting us read the room. Colonel King. Mrs. King. Eric, this is my team. And if you want to brief them, you clear it with me first. I should have warned you I was moving the briefing forward. That's on me. But things escalated, I had to move fast. I have a duty to my team to stay ahead of the curve. I understand, Rachel, but CENTCOM has given their orders. Orders? I'm now commanding officer. I didn't mean for you to find out like this. Truly. I'm sorry, Rach. Somehow I doubt that very much. This is from Sox Central. She has already King has assumed control of this operation. ended the relationship mentally, so she, right now she's trying to push him away to make it seem like it's his fault. I'm going to need access to your network. I can already see that happen. I'll patch you through. Name? Dr. Stokes. You can call me Clarice. Dr. Stokes, please prepare the presentation. You found something? 
I wouldn't know. What the fuck is that? Modern art or something? This is footage from the highly classified Kalis program. That's supposed to mean something to me. Yes, sir. It's a thermal satellite system that I personally pioneered. Oh, well, I'm impressed. Please, pioneer away. You behave like this in all your briefings, Corporal? Boys are just eager to catch a break, sir. No harm meant. Very well. Satellite sweeps of the war dude. zone have uncovered what appears to be an underground storage facility. This will, of course, require further investigation, but I strongly suspect where Saddam's chemical weapons are hidden. We got you, you son of a bitch. CENTCOM has given the green light to raid the facility and seize any weapons on site. Hostilities may be over, but there are holdout groups of Republican Guard all over the country. They could deploy those weapons at any time, so we need to move fast. The army is giving us a ride out there in their helos. On arrival, Lieutenant Kolchak will lead the raid on the facility. Once it's secured, we'll carry out a full weapons inspection. Now listen up. There's been a change of leadership, but Rachel's operational expertise and local knowledge is just as valuable as ever. She'll be flying with us, and I want you all to show her the same respect. Any questions? What the fuck are we waiting for? I'm ready. It's tribal territory out there, Colonel. Make no mistake, those people are feral. I take it we're getting their support? Nah, too many birds can bring them down on us. We move fast in, fast out. Yeah, that's pretty much what your mama said to me. Hey, careful, boy. If I didn't pull out so fast, it could have been your papi. <laughs> All right, that's enough, Merwin. Sir, what's your call? Um... We keep this thing small. If it goes south, I'll pull the plug and we can bug out. With all due respect, I think that's the wrong call. With all due respect, Lieutenant Kolchak, it's not your decision to make. Yes, babe. This feel right to you? I'm still Merwin has a point. If we spin up too many problems. helos, we'll increase our chance of being spotted. Any concerns, see me after the briefing. We go dark until weapons are secured. If we don't break radio sounds within 24 hours, CENTCOM will mount a rescue operation. A lot of shit can go down in 24 hours. I'll quit being a bitch. I'm just saying, that's all. This is why we went to war. This is what gets us out of bed every morning. Make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we stop Saddam from using these weapons. Be ready in one hour. Dismissed. Honestly, I know that a couple of them Three. didn't like the call, but Let I feel like a equipment. small team is a lot better than going in loud with their support. This don't feel right. I'm getting this tingle down the back of my neck. Oh, sweetie. Look, good rub down will sort that right out, huh? I'm serious. I got a real bad feeling about this. Oh, yeah, he's going to be first That's to die. Get Guaranteed. Spending too much time with Eric. Is there anything you can do? I'm going to download the latest satellite data. You can have some alone time with him. Thank you, Clarice. Eric, we need to talk. There's something I have to tell you. You should know. It wasn't my decision to take over your operation. It's been a long time since we last saw each other. Eric. Please. Let me finish. Not a day went by when you weren't on my mind, when I didn't want you by my side. I've missed you so much, Rach. This isn't about us, Eric. I just want things to go back to the way they were. How we left it, things weren't so great between us. We've been through worse, a lot worse. Just tell him already. Nothing has changed, Eric. Just tell him already. You know that. You and I, there is no you and I. It's over. Please, Rach. Don't say that. 
You're not wearing your wedding ring. Hey, be careful with that. Oh, shit, sorry. She got in that box of tricks anyway. What the fuck is that? Ultraviolet light. We use it to sweep for explosives. Let me have a go. No. How much longer for that download, Clarice? I need it ASAP. It's five minutes ASAP enough for you? Downloading data now. Good. I'll check the satellite maps. Oh, yeah. Not the greatest bandwidth. The no wedding we thing is gone. Design is 1348. Hardcore. Huh? Equipment release form. Can you. Oh, sure. Check all equipment, then check it again. Yeah, I hear you. Can I talk to her? Is this what I think it is? WP, sir. White phosphorus? It's just for popping smoke. That's all. These are only to be used for cover. Understood? Understood. After all, Saddam is the one who's breaking weapons conventions. Not us. Oh, wait. Hold on. What is that? What is that? What is that? What the hell do we need this crap for? We need to be mobile. We need to be prepared. The facility is underground, possibly under construction. It's safer this way. You want me to feel safe? Give me some more shooters. So, you're my technician. I've heard about you. I should fucking hope so. I'm here to keep our gear in check. And if any Iraqis pop their heads up, I'll take them clean fucking off. You seem pretty confident, Corporal. If you need any assistance with the climbing gear, I'm here to help. Sure, I'll manage, Colonel. No respect from the technician? Okay. Climbing gear. Fucking pencil pusher. Think we'll bag Chemical Ali at this facility? If he's in the vicinity, we'll get him. <laughs> that almost makes it worth the risk. Almost. Well, you know, I'd still rather be sitting behind a desk. Sir, I've heard some fucked up stories about the border. You sure you don't want air support? There's a chance we're needed. We have the element of surprise on our side. I will not allow anything to jeopardize that. Please, Colonel. Can we take a step back and think about this for a minute? I've made my decision. You feeling lucky, Lance Corporal? Well, my parents owned a horse named Lucky. He ran away. Bet the farm on this. I have a good feeling we're gonna clear up. I wish I shared your optimism, Colonel. I can't talk to her. Alright, I guess there's nothing special that I can see from that. Hey, the love of my life who's betrayed me and cheated on me. How you doing? What about you guys? Can I talk to you guys? No, I can't. Actually, you know what? 
I've already read most of that, so if you guys want to go back and read that, you can. That's fine. What is? Oh wait, what is this? Mission accomplished, President Bush. I guess no. I guess I didn't need to read that. Never mind. Cool. I guess I don't need to read anything that has words on it at all, ever. Secret found. Don't know what any of that means, but okay, at least I found something cool. There it is. Downloads complete. Let's get to the helos. by that look on your face. What do you think I am? I take it you're talking about the skipper? Hey, nice guy. Around here, nice don't cut it. What do you think of him? Like he's got something else on his mind? Mm. You have no idea. Stubborn and courageous. Ooh, okay. Oh, he has. Ooh, who does he have a present for? I wonder. Is it for the missus? It's for the missus. Zane, and a gate. Zane. Okay, find Zane. Search, search Zane's room. Inspect. Happy birthday, Zane. My boy is becoming a man. Love always dies oh, for his son. Aww. How sweet. Our Mr. Zane Hoffman, March 3rd, 2003. Where has approved your application for admission to Highgate University to read mythology? Alright, if you guys want to read through that, you can, but I'm just going to skim through it. And if you guys want to pause, you, you can. Feel free to do so. That's the picture, bro. Uh -huh. Oh, your son has a creepy ass smile. Holy shit. And oh, wait, why is her picture covered? God, why are all their smiles so damn creepy? Can I exit? At the, no, I can't. I'll just get a close up of his face. Very bored. Very lifelike, though. For these type of games, it's hard to get, like, such a realistic, life-like face, but, you know. Open, let's see, let's walk in here first. Is there anything that is lighting up at all? Oh, Zane. You here, bud? Zane? Zane, you here? I know I just kind of barged in, but it is my house and I pay the fucking bills. Mesopotamian mythology. 
book them pages. Okay. What is Sonic version of Horror Fab D? So it's the ancient Mesopotamian underworld. In the ancient belief, the world was made of earth, sky, earth, sea, and sky, and enclosed in a box of imperishable tin. The underworld, known as Kerr, or the House of Ashes, was where people went when they died. Souls were led to a cavern deep underground where they endured a shadowed existence. Here, the only drink was dust and the only food was clay. There was no light, only darkness. There were no rewards or punishments for deeds done in life. Instead, a soul's comfort was determined by their burial. As the dead were often buried under or near the home, daily sacrifices of food and drink were made to the spirits of the departed. Family members who poured wine into a dead person's grave would quench their thirst in the house of ashes. The message to the living was to live well, be buried richly, and to have many descendants who would supply food and drink in the afterlife for years to come. The dead could return to the earth as ghosts to punish those descendants who did not leave offerings of food and drink to them. Vengeful ghosts could inflict misfortune and sickness on the living, and maladies such as headaches, stomach pains, fever, and mental disorders could be attributed to ghosts. Mesopotamian healers ascribed many illnesses to the action of ghosts, while others were caused by gods or demons. Good to know. Is that it? I think that's it. Alright, let's see. What else? I will say the camera angles aren't necessarily the best. Oh, yeah, look at me. Look at me. I look high and tired all at the same time. How do I, how can I switch camera angles? Jeez, good lord. There's something else I was supposed to look at, but I can't necessarily look at it because I can't move the damn camera. There we go. Alright, so... He has... Loch Ness Monster, I'm guessing. Her horse. He has oh weird witch lady. Has a cat. Well, it looks like Stonehenge. A circle of nothingness. But nice, 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 nice. Okay, don't know what any of that means. And what is what is this? Saying Tanny. Saying please. What do you mean not again? Uh, I don't know what any of that is. Hello. Uh, hello, Anna Salim. Salim. Salim Garkun. Abu Zain. I forgot. Who was Zain? Ma, ma. Who was Zain? My abnik. Tariq. Hey, wah, Tariq. Who ma ma baad? Rahu yaqdul to be fair. Who's that? No, no. Everything is fine. I just came here with my dad. Don't want to worry anyone. Ah. لما يرجع ابعته لي حالا ما اقدرش اقول امتى هيجي انت عارف الولاد اي وقت ابعته لي لو سمحت طبعا good job not spreading any panic at least yet we'll put the fear of god in this boy لا 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 يا ديني مش دلوقتي كابتن بصري اهلا أنا مولاي لازم نتحرك على طول. أنت بتقول إيه سعادتك؟ العدو جاي يا سليم. العدو جاي علينا دلوقتي. العدو؟ يا فندم الحرب خلصت خلاص وخسرنا. لا ده كلام فارغ، محدش اتسلم. العدو جاي ودي أرضنا وإحنا لازم نتعرب ليها. شايفينهم؟ مطلوب تأكيد. يلا. شوف جايين علينا. بقول لك إحنا محتاجين كل راجل في مكانه. لحسن طايرتهم توصل عندنا ما اقدرش اعمل ده يا فندم ابني محتاجني ده امر يا جندي مش طلب لو واجب عليك 
damn it. He was about ready to shoot that dude. Simply because he wanted to find his son. Are you kidding me? I got a bit of right. That's some bullshit. There might not be no after this. Coyote 2, this is Mailman 21 Actual. You're on approach. Ready to go dark. Over. Roger that. Gang of Mike, over. We'll see you on the other side. All call signs, silence, silence. There's silence, no fortunate son playing? Left. Really? Ugh. This ain't a proper what's helicopter ride boy? in a badassery without bad. fortunate son. Hey, Marvin. What's your mama and the Bermuda Triangle have in common? Why are you fucking in life? They both swallow Marines. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good, boy. Damn. Hey, look. Your mama's so nasty. I called her for phone sex and I got a fucking ear infection. Well, damn. How long you been sitting on that one? Oh, yeah, you like that? I got a shit ton more of those bad boys lined up. Yeah, that's what your mama said. You two want to cut the bullshit and focus on the mission? Hey, only one place I let a woman boss me around like that, all right? And that's between the sheets. I'm surprised your mom lets women into your bedroom. Don't want her getting jealous now. Yeah, right. Hey! What the fuck y'all laughing at? Sergeant Kenny, I need you to establish contact with the AWACS CP on four hour intervals. Sergeant K, are you with me? Yeah, I got it. Contact CP every four hours. Hey, whatever's going on in there, compartmentalize that shit. I need you here with me. Can I count on you? I'll ask you one more time. Can I count on you? Yeah, I got you. I got your back, Nikki. No matter what. I know it. Make sure you do. Temper five. Temper five. Temper also, they're five? friends? What's that, some kind of Boy Scout thing? It's a marine thing. They know each other. Marines always loyal. So what, it's supposed to be lucky? Marines have a boatload of superstitions. Hit me with one. But this gets even oh, worse. They say to never look back when you're disembarking the helo. Otherwise you curse the whole team. That's gotta be about the stupidest thing I have ever heard. Yeah, well maybe. But as I see it, why take a chance? Eyes forward at all times. You look backwards in a war zone. It's no wonder you get your ass shot off. Good to go, Marines. This is what we were sent here to do, and may God be my witness, we're gonna succeed. Amen to that, brother. Hoorah! Hoorah! God, their relationship. That's why he's so upset. It's because they're cool. They're really close. They're battle buddies. They've been through the shit. Captain, what's in there? Ha ha ha! Yeah, they're selling the Khanazir American, the Asakir, the American, go, sir. We've been made. Awaiting orders. Help the team. Shut the building in front. Copy that. CQC, move. 
Better to be safe than sorry, unfortunately. Can't take the chance. On me! Prisoners are playing ball. Roger. Get Corporal Merwin to pop yellow smoke at the LC and bring in the Colonel. This rings a bust. These people are not the enemy, they're just shepherds. Ooh, I messed up. Ooh, I messed up bad. Lieutenant Goldcheck, sit rep if you will. Sir, we secured the farm with minimal casualties. Casualties? How minimal are we talking? Took one down. Was this casualty a hostile or a civilian, Lieutenant Kolchak? We didn't get a chance to make introductions, ma'am. Was he armed? Have you located an entrance to the underground silo? Negative, sir. If there is one, it's well camouflaged. If there is one. What does that mean, Lieutenant? Colonel, I don't think these men are hostile. I'm starting to think they're just shepherds. Are you sure? Couldn't it be a cover? If these are civilians, Lieutenant Kolchak, then you just killed an innocent man. That went smoothly. You think? Got the place locked down tighter than a virgin. Do not finish that sentence, Corporal. Are they ready for questioning? Yeah, just don't ask them any tough physics questions. Let's go. Stay sharp. If anyone so much as raises an eyebrow, I want to know about it. Copy that. I don't know about you guys, but something doesn't feel right about this place. Oh, yeah? So is that this, uh, women's intuition I keep hearing about? Yeah, you want to find out what happens when you piss it off? <laughs> All due respect, but you weren't there and I ain't taking no chances. Well, that's just great. It is what it is. No, Lieutenant, it's not. You killed a man. And maybe we can use this to our advantage. Assalamu alaikum, ya akhi. لازم أسأل السؤال ولازم تقول الحقيقة فين مدخل مخزن السلاح uh, might just be best to stay quiet on this one هسألك مرة ثانية فين مكان المخزن What the hell is that? Some kind of effigy. Possibly pagan. Ada! Hataharafu Urayu. What the fuck? Into can hina. That is not a good sign at all. All right, boys, let's get the fuck out of here. I've had enough of this. Corporal, keep an eye on the captives. You heard him, Marine. Silo is. This man was armed, ma'am. Everyone in this country is armed. Do 
في بندقية كبيرة قوية أكتر من اللي أنت محتاجه للغنم فين مدخل المخزن؟ Stand down, Lieutenant. The only language these people understand. I've got this under control. Are there any more captives? Yeah, in the other hut. Follow me. I'm not making him look good right now. This is awful. Keep a firm eye on this one. I need to be a little less harsh. She's gonna turn a gun on me. Okay. They're still there. All right, I guess we're good now. Watch your marines search the whole farm. I mean every inch of it. Look under every bed, shed, and outhouse. The entrance to the silo is close by. Go find. Hey, what are you looking at? I swear Murrins brought some bad juju down on us. I don't believe in curses, the Tooth Fairy, or Santa Claus. The Tooth Fairy, yeah. Santa? Say it ain't so. You truly fucked up Christmas, man. Look, there's somebody threw a few presents in the fire. Is there any place I can look at? Yeah, I'm hoping I didn't really fuck us up too bad. Okay. There ain't shit here. You got something to say, Sergeant? Look at the ground. What do you see? Jack shit. There was a silo, where's all the tracks? Nah. Man, this is a fishing expedition. His precious Kalis has got it all wrong. We follow orders, Sergeant. The search is far from over. Aye, sir. Uh, ooh, what is this? We got some gas masks here. Some shepherds need gas masks. أنا بشخص الحكومة الأمريكية. أنت في موقف صعب جدا. مهم إنك تقول الحقيقة. فين؟ مدخل المغرب That's heroin It just keeps getting better by the minute <laughs> These people are nothing but common crooks. What the fuck was Eric thinking? I want this place turned inside out.
That was fucking close. Whoa! Fucking rush, huh? Rachel! Where are you? Rachel! Quick! Stay back! So she's handling a lot better than he is. <laughs> What a fucking roll right there, man. Hell yeah. I'm fucking dying, Nick. Bullshit. Ah. I know you're hurting, but you're not fucking dying. I'm still, calm down. It's your flesh when it's a paper cut. Just hold still. Liar. Fuck, I called it too, man. I knew it was gonna be the first one. What are you waiting for? Spread out and fight back! God damn it. All call signs, this is drop kick. Silence lifted. Can someone give me a sit rep on the contact? Over. Drop kick, this is killjoy until we are under fire and going down. Targets have advanced into the LZ. Is this getting worse? Yes. In fact, it can. Get down on the floor. I swear I'll put a fucking hole through you. I'm not going to. Doesn't anyone speak English anymore? Wait, what did that mean? You better not miss. No more killing. Ah, 
Merwin! Jason! Alrighty guys, well unfortunately that is all the time I have for the night, but if you did enjoy the uh, first part of House of Ashes Let's Play, please feel free to uh, share that by commenting down below, hitting that follow button, it would really help me out, like subscribe, all that. But anyways, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.